A C-section is a special surgery doctors use to help a mom deliver her baby through her tummy instead of the usual way. Doctors usually choose a C-section when they think it's the safest option for the mom, the baby, or both. Sometimes, moms plan ahead for this type of delivery. That's called an elective C-section, usually scheduled around 39 weeks of pregnancy. If a mom has had a C-section before, doctors often recommend having another one for the next baby. Doctors may do a C-section for several reasons. The baby's head is too big to fit through the mom's hips. Placenta previa. The placenta blocks the baby's way out. Breech baby. The baby is upside down with feet down instead of the head. Umbilical cord problems or baby distress. The baby might not be getting enough oxygen. The mom is having twins or more babies. The mom has a pelvic tumor, cervical cancer, or an active herpes infection. The baby is very large, weighing more than four kilograms. How the surgery starts. First, doctors put a small tube catheter in the mom's hand for medicine and another in her bladder. A sheet is placed so she doesn't see the surgery. To make sure she feels no pain, doctors use general anesthesia. Mom is asleep, used in emergencies. Regional anesthesia, like spinal, this is safer, it numbs the lower body, and mom stays awake without pain. Surgical steps. The doctor makes a cut on the tummy, it can be vertical. But usually, it's a horizontal cut low on the belly, bikini line. They carefully cut through layers, skin, fat, muscle, and a thin layer called the peritoneum, to reach the baby. The bladder is moved to the side for safety. The doctor makes a cut in the uterus, breaks the amniotic sac, and lifts the baby out. The umbilical cord is cut, and the baby is wrapped in warm towels and checked. The placenta is gently removed. Finally, the doctors stitch all the layers back together. A whole surgery usually takes 15 to 30 minutes. Recovery moms usually stay in the hospital for four to seven days. Walking soon after surgery helps heal faster. It eases gas pains, helps with bathroom trips, and prevents blood clots. The cut heals in eight to 12 days, and over time, the scar becomes thinner, flatter, and blends in with the skin.